Finally! <laughs> what is going on, What's up, bro? Man? It's about time. <laughs> it's about How time. Are you? Guess who I'm with? Guess who I'm with? Stuff HD, Stuff What's HD. Up? Uh, Miguel Angel over here. Wait, I, I'm all zoomed in. What the heck? You're all zoomed in. Yeah. All up in my face, all up in my grill. There we go. How you There's doing? Miguel Angel. Hey. Hey. We, we gotta. I already decided, by the way, next time we gotta go there. Which one is that one? Oh, bombers. bombers? You know what? All this not, time not living good. here. I've never been to Bombers, even the one in downtown. I've heard good things, so we gotta never try. Never been to downtown. Two Bombers. <laughs> I've been in downtown, but not Bombers. Or oh, the yeah, other yeah. place too. Um, which one is it? Sobermans? Oh, that I guy been, never been I've there. I've been to either. the one by the university. I, so that's it was good. It was good. Yeah. It was so good. if it was good, if he said it's good, it's good then. Yeah, sure. You heard that, right? <laughs> Obviously, I like food though. So <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome, man. <laughs> Finally, it's crazy because. I've been knowing Javier for a great while, I'm telling you. And it's just amazing how we just came about. I was watching a Hayden video and then I made a comment or something like that. And I guess he went to my channel and then from my channel he saw this well, video. Originally you had something that stuff for the beard. Correct, yes. yeah. Yeah. So yeah. then he made another comment about you some other time and I was like, oh, let me check this guy out. Right, right. Then so I was like, like, I see one of your videos and it's like, Wait, this guy's from Milwaukee? Like, yeah, yeah, so we came back and we were like, oh my God, this is crazy, because it's like, I knew his sister from back then, and they say, yeah. it just, it's a small world. It is a very, yeah. very small world, it's just crazy. That's the other yeah. funny part, because I used to go to school with your sister too. Right. So, yeah, it, it was weird. It is crazy. <laughs> She's amazing. She, she's a blast. Um, but she came over with, with her family and we, we had all this amazing Puerto Rican food. Like I said on my vlog, I, I tend to always order like mofongo with carne frita because when they do it really good, I really, really like it, you know, but, but too often it's just okay. So that leaves me like looking at everybody else's plates. Right. It's like one thing about Milwaukee ever since, well, since I was a little kid, um, there's many, many Puerto Rican restaurants, and see the thing about here in Milwaukee is, I, going back to this, there's plenty of Puerto Rican restaurants that have opened, and it seems like the first week, two weeks, it's just perfect, right? It's amazing that first. Chuleria, okay? But then after that, it's like it starts slacking. The food, we heat it, this and that, you know, some stuff, it tastes good, we heat it, the next day sometimes it tastes even better but you know when it's old and it's like not even the microwave wants to cook it anymore <laughs> but it just it's it, it say cierran they close the restaurant uh, or else you go there and all of a sudden i want an arroz con gandula with this this and that lo siento mucho pero no tenemos arroz con gandula hoy o lo siento mucho y no tenemos chuleta frita hoy o lo siento so it's like that, that, that would always piss me off uh, about Puerto Rican places. Um, not just here, in many places, but, but they have this menu with, with like a hundred things or whatever, but they don't have like 90 of them. No. It's always like, no, that, that's only on Saturdays. Yeah. Well, well, then put it, put it in the menu. Yeah. See? Yeah. Just, just, just uh, give us some information. Right. Some I've always been like, look, if you cannot make it every day, 
then don't put it in the menu yes. or at least make it specific oh this is on weekends or whatever oh the un horario horario the yeah. lunch time you know but, but no too too often it's like no se nos acabó yeah. nos acabó el pernil <laughs> that's another thing too <laughs> But, you know, when me and Javier were talking about where we're going to meet and all of that, and I was like, you know what? I haven't had Puerto Rican food for a while. Um, I was thinking about this place that they opened new in the south side of Milwaukee, and I think it's called Sofrito. And he was like, yeah, Sofrito Vega, right? Yeah, Sofrito, Sofrito Vega. Vega, right? Because I heard great things about that place. But it's like Javier kept on throwing the whole pizza thing, you know? Oh, pizza, oh, pizza. Then I see the video and I saw why he wanted pizza, because he just had some <laughs> Puerto Rican food not too long ago. So I'm over here eating pizza again with Javier over here. So I'm surprised you don't have a... You, you didn't complain. <laughs> <laughs> because I heard it was Pizza Man, so Pizza Man is a great pizza too, so... All right, so my channel is a little bit complicated. Uh, my channel has never been about any one specific thing. Um, I, I call my say, myself stuff because way back in the day I used to write like a vlog, blog, uh, and I used to call it stuff because I didn't know what specifically I wanted to talk about. It was always more about technology, but every once in a while I like to rant about something that I hate or what. So. So, so yeah, it's stuff HD because uh, it's in HD. <laughs> my, 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 my friend is always asking me like, what is the HD? Like, I'm like, well, it's either high definition or high density or whatever. Um, yeah, stuffhd.com. Uh, my name, by the way, is Javier Torres. Uh, but yeah, I just go by stuff. But, but yeah, I, I, I tend to do a lot of uh, I used to. I've been doing this for, for like over five years, and I used to do mostly like tech, uh, tech stuff, tech news, or whatever. Because I'm a, I'm a I'm a geek. I love technology, but uh, that never really got much attention because you know there's a million places to get much better tech news. You know, you, you go to uh, MKBHD, you go to Techno Buffalo, you go to so many other channels that are better and are faster. So when I started growing more is when I made the big decision to move to Puerto Rico. Uh, I, I had been done with, with the whole corporate world, the whole... Uh, I started minimizing back in 2016, uh, December 2016. So, so I wanted to get rid of everything and move to Puerto Rico and live a simple life. And I did move to Puerto Rico and I was living a simple life until September 20th. <laughs> when Maria came and <laughs> Maria, 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 no se fue. Maria actually came. Uh, so, so that kind of changed my plans a, a little bit. Yeah. I ended up having to come back, but um, you know, my, my plan is still to to regroup uh, and move back to Puerto Rico eventually, uh, but with much more be much more prepared because I, I wasn't prepared at all the first time. I, I do have a little piece of land over there that I want to build a little home and, and it'll be awesome. You, you and, and how many people for the first three, three million, six million people were not prepared. Yeah, in your situation, not prepared for well, yeah. what you were expecting, but who was prepared for Maria? Nobody was prepared for Maria. And after going through something like that, it just threw your plans all the way off. It threw my plans all the way off, but not completely. I mean, the truth is that Puerto Rico had plenty of issues before Maria. You know, I had been looking for work the whole time I was there, uh, and I couldn't find work. Like, it just kept sending my resume to places and sending it, and, and it just wouldn't happen. So even before Maria, I had I already kind of knew that, that I was going to end up having to... Thank <laughs> you. Even before Maria, I knew that I was going to have to come back uh, because, you know, what I wanted was a simple job uh, where, where, you know, I could do whatever and make enough to live. But even then, I, I couldn't find it. And then once Maria came, I was like, okay, for sure, I'm not going to find it now. Uh, but that's why I said, you know, I left thinking that I was going to be able to just find a job and whatnot, uh, and I couldn't. Um, 
but next time I go, it's go I'm going to be much more prepared for that type of stuff. I mean, before that, when was the last time you lived in Puerto Rico? Living or visiting? No, living, living. Because visiting and living is so Yeah, uh, it was... We have moved... <laughs> We have moved from Puerto Rico October 28th to um, uh, 1989, which was a month after Hurricane Hugo. Yeah, yeah. So, so it was kind of funny for me that I ended up having to come back like a month after Hurricane Maria. Like, so, so, so now, you know, my channel is always evolving. I get crazy ideas. I decide, oh, you know, I'm going to do this this way now. And, I'll try it out for a while. If I start getting bored, then I, I just find some other way of doing it. Because, yeah. like, like you mentioned, you know, we do this for fun. So if it's not fun for me, then it's like, why am I gonna do it? All right. Well, Javier. It was very nice. It, it was indeed. To finally get together with the man. And next the, time, bombers. Yeah, next time I'm up allá. Bombers right there. They got some. I think you were pointing great, at the cream, but it's okay. Great burgers. No, no, I was pointing at the bombers. <laughs> Let me see. Bombers right there, right there. The Oh, another thing is, another thing is, I promised this person that I was going to shoot her a shout out. And I think. I know you're, you know, who I'm gonna be talking about. Jennifer La Vida Mora, that oh, yeah, she I just know. met Hayden. You know who she is. Yes. She just wants me to say hi to you. Well, hi to Jennifer as well. There you go, Jennifer. Muchas gracias a todos por ver este precioso video con Javier, Stuff HD. La información de él lo va a dejar en description abajo de este. StuffHD.com. StuffHD.com. ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? That's it. Just go to StuffHD.com. If you want to follow me on Instagram or Twitter, it's at RealStuffHD. And that, that's really it. There you go. Muchas gracias. Dios me lo bendiga a todos. Hasta la próxima. God bless you. Nos vemos.